Hey sisters, Donna Parto here welcoming you to day 26 of your 90 day renewal in spirit, soul, and body. And today I want to give you a proposal. Are you ready? The 90 day proposal, 30, 30, 30. Are you ready? 30 minutes a day for your spiritual life. 30 minutes a day in your prayer chair, your prayer place, connecting with God. I would encourage you to make that before the rest of the family wakes up and gets in gear. First thing, meet with God. Take that 30 minutes and give it to Him for your spirit. 30 minutes for your soul. And in that, I want to talk about your outward appearance. Because I really do believe that as you go through the day and you walk past a mirror or you, know, you look down at yourself and you feel bad about your appearance, it really is an emotional drain. Also, People, whether we like it or not, people really do treat you differently. When you put yourself together and go out into the world and you look your, you know, look your best, you don't have to look like a movie star. You know, it's amazing. I'm a homeschooling mom and for many, many years, I was just around the house in my junk clothes and my PJs all day. I'm telling you the truth. And uh, God really convicted me about that and the example that I was setting for my girls who now are 13 and 19. And, you know, mom's just always looking like slob around the house. And so I made a decision. Mm, I don't know, maybe a couple years ago, not to do that anymore and to take 30 minutes in the morning to groom and to put on a half decent outfit, throw on some jewelry, do a little bit with my hair, a little bit of lip gloss, whatever, just spruce it, just 30 minutes, you know, not over the top, but to present myself to my family. And if, you know, someone stops by a delivery man or whatever and to the outside world, even if I'm just going to check the mailbox, then I feel better about myself. And, you know, I used to be first in line to scoff at that kind of thing. But, you know, my daughters have both said to me, Mommy, we love the fact that we don't have to be embarrassed of you. You know, teenagers are always embarrassed of their moms, right? They say, you know, Mommy, we love the fact that you're a pretty mommy. I mean, you know, I'm not a movie star here, but you know, the, what they're talking about is, Mommy, you're, you've got self-respect. Mommy, you know, even though we're homeschooled, we're not sitting here, you know, with you and a bag of potato chips and, you know, the proverbial denim jumper day after day. And they really appreciate that. And I've even had friends of my children make comments to me, you know, that they like the fact that I take care of myself and, you know, I'm kind of a, you know, a little bit of a together looking mom. They like that. And then the last 30 is, actually I should have put this before that, but the other 30 is exercise. 30 minutes for your body. We're doing spirit on body here. 30 minutes for your body. And again, going back to that book, um, Aging Well by George Valiant, which uh, recaps the study at Harvard University, the most intensive study on how do you age well ever conducted. And they found that just 30 minutes of moderate exercise performed four days a week is enough to make a major difference in your overall health. So what do you think, sisters? Isn't that reasonable? 30, 30, 30. 30 minutes on your spirit, time alone with God. 30 minutes making yourself look presentable on the outside, ready to face the world so that your soul, your mind, your will, and your emotions will feel better about the day. And then 30 minutes for your body, 30 minutes of moderate exercise. I think you should do it every day, but at least four days a week. Make sure you get to that. I think that's going to make a big difference in your life, don't you? That's it for today. I'm Donna Parto with your 90-day renewal in spirit, soul, and body.